In Health Watch this evening, researchers are studying the link between breast cancer and alcohol. They know that drinking could increase the chances of cancer for women of all ages. As Natalie Brand reports, scientists are now trying to pinpoint why and who is at most risk. Jessica Budkara is living with metastatic breast cancer. I would be lying to say that it's not something that you don't think about constantly. Her first diagnosis came at age 37. Nearly four years later, she learned it had spread. I started reevaluating any negative kind of vices that all of us have. That includes alcohol, a known risk factor for cancer. There are hundreds of studies that show there's a direct association between consumption of alcohol and breast cancer risk. Dr. Cynthia Zano, a breast cancer survivor herself and researcher at Johns Hopkins, is trying to dig into why. We're looking at how the alcohol alters our DNA. And the reason we're doing that is we'd like to know who's at risk. The American Cancer Society says women who have one alcoholic drink a day have a 7 to 10 percent increase in risk up to three drinks a day, 20% higher risk. And while cancer prevention guidelines say it's best not to drink alcohol, it's recommended women limit their intake to no more than one drink a day. Be mindful of how much you drink and how often. I want to raise awareness for my daughter and for other women just to know that this is one thing that we can change. Jessica Budkara now stocks her fridge with alternatives to alcohol and indulges in extreme moderation. It's really just being intentional and deliberate and being a lot more aware. Her cancer is responding to treatment and she's taking every step possible to live a long, healthy life. Natalie Brand, CBS News, Washington. Scientists say that younger women might be especially vulnerable because breast tissue is most sensitive to environmental exposures during their teens and 20s.